Welcome to A Bill a Minute from GovTrack, your short breakdown of interesting bills in Congress. I'm Jesse Rifkin. Now, more and more states are legalizing recreational marijuana. In fact, every state where the issue was on the ballot in November 2020 voted to legalize, and several more have followed suit in 2021 so far, including New York and Virginia. However, the drug does still technically remain illegal on a federal level, and as a result, other institutions such as banks and insurers who may wish to do business with state legal marijuana businesses remain wary. So a new bill in Congress called the Claim Act would ban criminal prosecutions of insurers who work with state legal marijuana businesses. In this case, the Claim Act stands for the Clarifying Law Around Insurance of Marijuana Act. Now, the House version was introduced by New York Democratic Representative Nydia Velazquez, while the Senate version was introduced by New Jersey Democratic Senator Bob Menendez. Now, supporters argue that a state legal business shouldn't face additional economic barriers that apply to basically no other, no other state legal business in, in any other industry. But opponents counter that the, the drug still does technically remain illegal on a federal level. And unless that changes, which it might, Democrats and Congress are talking about changing it, but unless that changes, you know, we shouldn't pretend otherwise. Uh, opponents also counter that the bill is a solution in search of a problem, perhaps. Uh, as the National Law Review reported in a March article, quote, there has been no reported federal action taken to date against any insurance company or broker that works with state compliant marijuana businesses. Well, this, this might be a risk on my part, but right here, live on camera, I'm gonna, I'm gonna show you some pot that I have, check this out. See, I, uh, I bought this at a yard sale. It's, it's, it's great, it's well-constructed and you know, you can hold things in it. 